today i am showing you this uh, 16 years old male patient who presented to me with double vision after trauma to the left eye according to him he had a road traffic accident and lower eyelid was detached from the medial canthus with canalicular laceration as well now direct closure to the medial canthus was done without canalicular repair ideally such wounds are repaired with pigtail anyhow that happened six months back and good news is that there is no epiphora but one month after the repair he felt double vision now if you can see there is left hypertropia as well diplopia after trauma especially to the lower eyelid brings only one thing to mind and that is orbital floor blowout fracture with entrapment of the muscles but on palpation there was no emphysema no orbital floor discontinuity no enough thalamus and then i felt uh, some swelling in the inferior fornix and there uh, was uh, this large conjunctival cyst that was causing uh, to push the globe upwards causing left hypertropia and diplopia patient told me that uh, the cyst formed one month after trauma as well and it was excised by the ophthalmologist but it has recurred again well that is conjunctival retention cyst and ideal management is marsupialization look at the mortality of this patient superiorly both eyes move equally lateral and right and left both moves equally but inferiorly there is marked restriction of the left eye movement now that is due to this large inferior conjunctival cyst now the patient said that the this cyst is gradually increasing and double vision is also gradually increasing mean that the two images are forming further and further to each other now this is a challenging case as we have confirmed there is no orbital floor fracture on ct scan we can safely perform marsupialization of this large inferior fornicial conjunctival cyst if you remove it any other way like it was done before it will recur again and again so that's why you should know the art of performing marsupialization i have told the patient that i can do it now let's see when he decides to perform surgery because hypertropia is increasing diplopia is increasing so that was an interesting case and i thought i should share with my viewers i hope you liked it if you like my videos don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you very much